Diamondback starting pitcher today. Right hander Zach Davies who gets the ball to close out the season's first half. Zach still looking for some consistency. The Diamondbacks have lost his last five starts. Yeah, two starts ago, he was as good as we've seen Zach uh, Davies. Seven strong innings and shut out baseball against Tampa Bay, that strong Tampa Bay offense. And their leadoff hitter is going to be Swinsky, as we mentioned, the center fielder. There you go. Good start for Zach. Swinsky has struck out now six times in the series. He was caught looking three times yesterday. Ryan Reynolds, the left fielder. That's fair. To tell Marte from the outfield grass. Good start for Davies. Two down. The MLB draft is later today. Pirates have the first overall pick for the second time in the last three years. They took this guy, Henry Davis, the last time they had the number one pick. That was two years ago. Oh, what a play by Emmanuel Rivera. A shot off the bat of Henry Davis. And Emmanuel Rivera goes top shelf with a good start for Zach Davies. And Carmen Majinski, first major league start. And that's a good start to lead off walk. Yep. Strike three call. It's a nice call right there. Pirates get away with a call. Nice job by Hedges right there framing this ball at the top of the zone. Corbin Carroll going to go to Seattle. The 2 0 is in the air to center. Back a few steps now trying to come in and making a sliding catch. Sawinski was frozen for a moment. Comes in and makes a nice catch to. Take care of out number two. Back to first goes Perdomo. Perdomo gets a head start. Walker takes ball four. Second walk in the inning for Majinski. Two on and two out for Guriel. Cars on the move. Hedges throw to second. Hells into center field. Perdomo comes home. Pressure, pressure, pressure. It's one nothing Diamondbacks. Curtis hits a pop up to first base. Santana near foul ground. And he's got it. They strand Walker at third. But a couple of walks. Stolen base and pressure leads to a 1 0 Diamondback lead. Now Davies returns the favor with a leadoff walk here in the second inning. G Man Choi picked up a hit yesterday, his second game back off the injured list. High fly ball deep to center field. Alec Thomas going back to the wall and clear the deck. Cannonball coming from G Man Choi. That was a blast to center and gives the Pirates a 2 1 lead, his third home run. Boy, do you need that. Your offense needs more of that uh, and that's why uh, G-Man Choi is a pirate and that's why they brought him in because he can do that. Going to inning at number three and Austin Hedges will step in. Going to the break swinging strike three by Hedges who couldn't hold up on a high fastball. And here's Sawinski batting for the second time. Well Bill Miller found another one down on that corner and Sawinski strikes out for the seventh time in this series. A nice swing by Reynolds. Turning around that fastball for a two out single. Rollins on base now with two outs for Henry Davis. He floats this one first base side. There's a play in foul ground for Walker who gloves it. Yeah, the inning comes to an end. One hit, one left. We go to the bottom of the third. Pirates two, Diamondbacks one. Alec had a pair of RBI hits late in yesterday's win. Of course, he had the home run to lead off the eighth inning that tied the game 1 1. Bidding for one more home run. He had one yesterday, and there's another one today. And we're tied at two. That's pretty good when you get a power hitter in that ninth spot in the order. <laughs> and just the sixth major league appearance all this year for the 27 year old right hander, Osvaldo Bito. Christian Walker gets first look. That's headed for the left field corner, and it's down there up against the bullpen fence. Christian Walker. Starts off the fourth with a stand-up double. And it's a leadoff man on for Lourdes Gurriel Jr. who fouled out of the first. Bouncing ball, weakly hit towards short. Coming in is Marcano and he throws and gets Gurriel. But Walker moves to third base with one out. And with the infield in, the batter is Emmanuel Rivera. High pop on the infield. Backpedaling out toward the grass, Santana. And at the edge of the dirt will make the catch. Runner has to hold. Big second out for Beto. He faces Jake McCarthy. And that's in the air to left, and Brian Reynolds has a beat on it. Several steps toward the line, makes the catch. Leadoff double. Beto keeps Walker on third. As we go to inning number five in Phoenix, it's the Pirates two, Diamondbacks two. We go to the fifth inning. Here's Tucapita Marcano. And he lines this into right field for a base hit. Marcano's second hit in nine at bats in this series, a leadoff base runner. And a fly ball oh, to yeah. shallow center field. That's going to drop in for a hit. Quickly in is Alec Thomas. Puts runners at first and second. And almost a given now that Austin Hedges will bunt. He's been used a lot as a bunter. Gets it down. Davies will pick it up. 
And throw to first. The second baseman covers. Sacrifice goes 1-4. Cattell Marte took that throw. Marcano to third and Gonzalez to second. Infield in with Jack Sawinski at the plate. Has struck out twice. That's going to be deep enough almost to the warning track. And Marcano able to score on the sack fly by Sawinski and the Pirates back in the lead. There you go. Execute run production. Pirates lead by one. Emmanuel Rivera starts things off for the Diamondbacks. Is a bouncer toward the left side and bobbled, dropped by Triolo. An error to start the bottom of the seventh. Lefty batter Jake McCarthy. De Los Santos delivers in a fly ball, shallow left center field and sliding to make the catch. Brian Reynolds, he goes into the knee slide and makes the catch. Boy, and he started that slide early. I was a little worried about that. Carson Kelly has struck out and bounced to third. Kelly bounces this ball, stabbed by the pitcher, throw to second, little low throw, but handled by Gonzalez, who has time to set himself and throw on to get Kelly in a 1-4-3 inning ending double play. And Choi gets his fourth at bat, his two run homer in the second, his third as a pirate. Line drive, right center field, there's a rocket that's gonna head to the wall and G-Man Choi is gonna head to second base with a one out double. Connor Joe is going to pinch run for G-Man Choi at second with one out. The batter, Jared Triolo, the Pirates' third baseman. Grounds this into right field, a base hit. Rebello waving home Connor Joe. McCarthy's throw to the plate is going to be late. And Jared Triolo singles to right to give the Pirates a two-run lead. It's 4-2. David Bednar out there for a second straight game. He Went one and a third yesterday and gave up two runs, one earned. Suffered his first loss of the season. Two away in the bottom of the ninth inning, and the batter is Jake McCarthy. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Raise the Jolly Roger. David Bednar, the renegade, earns the save. And the Pirates end the first half before the break with a big W in Phoenix.